It all started in December of uh, 2012 when I found out my ex-girlfriend had cheated on me with my brother. My life seemed to just fall apart. I went home for Christmas that year. It was just very difficult. Um, I seek comfort in drink and drugs. I didn't really talk to my family a lot at Christmas. I was very isolated. I came back to SCU in January and again I continued to drink. It wasn't unusual for me for the boys to see me just spilling down a bottle of vodka or a bottle of JD or something like that and then it all came to a head one night in January where I just fell apart, started crying and decided to pray. I didn't believe in God however I was just clinging on to any hope that I could. I thought it was silly. I, I thought my prayer was silly. I thought it was stupid however I was just trying to Clinging on to the hope. I woke up the next day, went to chapel, sat with the boys like normal, messing about. And the guest speaker came in, and as he started talking, he said word for word the prayer that I did that night. He spoke exactly the same words that I use, and he also used the same slang that I use. Um, it was quite incredible and it's from then that I knew God is real, God exists, is here for us. It was impossible for anybody, anybody else to have heard that prayer. I found more than just a hope in God, I found a, a peace and a freedom uh, which I've never had before. Um, I'm not going to lie, going out partying, having a drink was quite fulfilling but it's only fulfilling for the time that you're doing it. And now that I believe in God, there's a fulfillment throughout my life. I am Robert Coote, and I am redeemed.